before starting the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, share with your friends and like the video. Thanks for your support, now let's go to the video. As the saying goes, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Last year's Nissan Rogue shot to the top of the charts as our number one pick for compact SUVs. With 201 horsepower and 225 pounds FT, the 2023 model Rogue is the most powerful so far despite being powered by a small 1.5-liter three-cylinder engine and we were impressed with its standard safety features. So, it shouldn't be much of a surprise that the 2020 for Nissan Rogue doesn't change its successful formula very much. The biggest change touted for the 2024 Rogue is that it's the first Nissan with Google built in at least on the upper tier SL and Platinum trims. The new infotainment setup comes with Google Assistant, Google Maps, and more apps can be added via the Google Play Store. With Google being built into the infotainment system, it means that these apps and the features they provide can be used without being paired to a smartphone. The Rogue SL and Platinum will feature an always-on connection via for LTE modem, which is what enables standalone Google functionality. Those trims come with five years of basic connectivity. Having the Google Assistant built-in allows users to use voice commands, bring up things like navigation, send texts, or for listening to music. Since Google is cloud-based, Whatever points of interest you save in Google Maps via a smartphone app or browser will automatically be available provided that you're signed into your Google account. In the Rogue's system, if you're an iPhone user getting increasingly upset, as you read this, don't worry, Apple CarPlay will still be available in the 2020 for Nissan Rogue. On the S and SV trims, You'll need to plug in your iPhone to access CarPlay, but on SL and Platinum trims you can use CarPlay wirelessly. The same applies to Android Auto, down to the connectivity requirements. The SL and Platinum trims get a new 12.3-inch color touchscreen to navigate infotainment, while the S and SV trims have an 8.0-inch screen and will come standard with Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. The 2024 Nissan Rogue gets a brand new face, featuring Nissan's V-Motion grille and slightly ray-sculpted front bumper, while the headlights remain the same. The rear gets reworked as well, but the changes there are more subtle. The rear bumper features more color matching and has a more simpler shape than the 2023 model. Nissan says that, the inner taillights have been changed for 2024 as well, but if we're being honest, it's a struggle to see the difference there. The Platinum trim gets gloss black fenders, along with gloss black trim pieces on the front and rear along with a new set of 19-inch wheels. New colors include Everest White Pearl, Deep Ocean Blue Pearl, Baja Storm, and several two-toned options with a black roof. While Google integration and the refreshed exterior are new additions, many other areas of the 2020 for Nissan Rogue remain the same, though. That isn't necessarily a bad thing. Remember the 2023 Rogue is the number one pick for a reason. The same efficient and powerful 1.5 liter to 101 horsepower to 125 pounds FT3 cylinder engine carries over from 2023. The option to have any of the four available trims in front wheel or all-wheel drive. Configurations returns as well. With the exception of the new 12.3-inch touchscreen, the interior switch gear remains largely the same, though. The 2020 for Nissan Rogue will now feature USB-C ports exclusively. The wireless charging pad returns as standard equipment in the SL and Platinum trims. There is a new option for chestnut brown leather upholstery, for some nice contrast for those who choose to spring for it. The Nissan Connect telematics feature returns, 
but in 2024 buyers will get a three-year trial of the service rather than the six-month trial. That was previously included, Nissan Connect will be standard on SV and higher trims. The impressive Nissan Safety Shield 360 suite carries over from 2023 and includes automatic emergency braking with pedestrian detection, blind spot warning, rear cross traffic alert, lane departure warning, high beam assist and rear automatic braking. Propellant assist with intelligent cruise control comes back to the SV trim. The SL and Platinum trims get propellant with Navi Link, which automatically adjusts the vehicles. Speed ahead of curves and freeway exits based on GPS route. The 2024 Nissan Rogue looks like. It is primed to stick people with its winning formula. However, we don't have official pricing yet, and that will be a key factor in determining of Nissan can still offer the same value for money in the face of the current inflation issue. There are also other contenders to deal with like the Toyota RAV4, Kier Sportage, and Subaru Forester. It may not be as easy for the Rogue to stay on top this time around. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like.